This is the Weber Smoky Mountain Cooker Smoker. Uh, we ended up with the 18 inch version. It's about a medium size one. Uh, there are two other sizes available. There's the 14 inch and then a larger 22 inch version. And they are fairly easy to assemble. The only real assembly is you have to screw the legs on, but other than that, uh, it's pretty easy. Everything just kind of snaps together. Uh, inside the bottom, you have your ash grate. Uh, there's an actual, it comes with like an ash tray. I don't know what else to call it. Um, in the smaller version, the tray goes on the inside to catch your ashes. But on the larger versions, it goes on the outside. I don't see it as very helpful that way. I guess it's to catch anything that might come out of the little um, temperature um, vents. But anyway, so then you have uh, your coal grate and then your water bowl. And the point of having water is to help regulate the temperature inside the smoker. But you don't want to put real cold water in there otherwise your smoker is going to like cool down too much too fast so you can, if you use water you're going to want to use warmer water uh, and uh, then you have your middle grate and then you have a top grate which sits pretty much right at the top and then you have a lid and your lid has a temperature gauge so that you can gauge the temperature of the actual smoker uh, on the side of the top part of the smoker not the lid but kind of the top uh, tube I guess there is a hole and they provide you with a little plug that you can put a um, thermometer through like something with a wire that comes to a thermometer on the outside I actually got something that is a bluetooth thermostat and you can stick this thing in the meat and then it will it will tell you the temperature on your phone but you can't get because it's bluetooth if you get too far away it it will break the connection and i'm sure there are more expensive versions that work uh much better but this one was you know it actually came with the smoker and it works just fine as long as i don't get too far out of range um and then you have your door on the side which is where you're going to add coal or wood chips or more water if you need it um now, I will say that I have heard uh, pellet smokers are a lot easier to regulate. However, I do prefer the taste of a coal smoker. Also, um, the pellet smokers are gas or electric, and I really didn't have a way to connect either one at my place. So I ended up with the coal smoker, and I'm pretty happy with it, although it is a little more difficult to regulate the temperature. And we have had uh, one big fail where uh, it got super cold on me, but because I was watching everything, I had the... Um, I did, I'm kind of paranoid, so I went out after 30 minutes to check it, and the temperature had gone way down, so I was able to get the meat before it got ruined. But we've had several wins since we've got it, so I'm pretty happy with it. Thanks for stopping by.